Hi, I'm Tom Middleton. Um, some of them is Cosmos, Jedi Knight. Uh, I'm here outside Yotel, New York, on uh, 42nd and 10th. And uh, imagine you've just arrived, you've stepped out of your cab, um, the first thing you get actually is sound from these speakers we've mounted on the outside. Welcome to Yotel, New York. From the very beginning of the hotel experience, you get music and sound. Then walking through, There's a, a sound system installed in here and obviously want to enhance and augment the space with an appropriate bit of music program. So the first thing I want people to do is feel relaxed and calm. And then you can check in over here. Greetings, I am your Bart. May These I are the, uh, the kiosk check-in booths. Um, so this is pretty state-of-the-art. I mean, this is pretty future. I mean, to come to a hotel and have uh, what looks like an airport lounge check-in facility is pretty funky. And then, obviously, the first thing that gets people's attention is Yobot. And I don't know if your microphone's picking this up, but basically, all of the, the um, hydraulic processes I've recorded and sampled and integrated into the, the music soundtrack for this space. And you know, from a, a kind of tech geek perspective, it was such a treat to have a, a robot to make uh, sound samples with. So obviously the next thing you do, once you've checked in and you've been mesmerized by Yobot, stored your luggage, um, you've got a lift ride from ground control up to four, and it takes about seven to 10 seconds. So again, from um, sound architect perspective, this is an opportunity. Captive audience, what are you gonna do in those seven to 10 seconds? At this point, we're gonna ascend to four. So the most appropriate thing is an arpeggio. We've arrived at mission control, and you see down to the left here, this is the club lounge. Um, there's a DJ booth, there's uh, personal kind of cabins. Uh, these can be used daytime for Various purposes like business meetings, um, meet and greet, corporate kind of stuff. You can chill out and relax in the lounge area here. And at night time obviously it takes on a totally different function. Um, they can be kind of table service booths for a you know, weekend um, club experience. Um, there's even been talk of karaoke. Uh, I think you know, as, a, as a space it's pretty flexible and pretty funky. Um, so moving around through here. We're still in mission control. If you need to kind of do the upgrade thing or check and make sure uh, everything's worked out, there are humans, it's not just all about robots here. Um, out here, you've got um, the terrace area. I think we should go out on the terrace because it's, it's, uh, it's pretty nice. This is Manhattan's largest open air terrace, but obviously, many different purposes. Um, bar area, cracking view of uh, Times Square Zone. Get a nice cocktail, chill out, relax. The next zone I'm going to take you through is called the Green Lounge. And this is really the sort of during the daytime, it's a kind of relaxation, meet and greet, business chat. It's the space where you can actually focus. So sound design for this space is really important to get right and we'll, uh, we'll talk about that in a little while. Mission control into the Doyo restaurant, you start to get this sense of moving into somewhere different and you start to get this soundtrack which is basically a fusion of Latin American music um, and Asian music and it's designed to augment the flavors you get from Latin Asian tapas. This space is nice. In the night time, these uh, tables can lower down into the floor and this space can be used for performance, all kinds of stuff. Nice little booths here around the side. What are you going to give people for the amount of time it takes to get from floor 4 to floor 26? It's a little succinct amount of time, so um, my idea is to 
is classic TV film jingles and theme tunes, which are normally about 30 to 45 seconds. So you might come across the singing a theme to the Flintstones because I just popped it in your head. You're going to go check out one of the rooms. I've even seen one of these, the bunk rooms. Wow, look at that. This is one of the ones that's That's cool. Look at that. Amazing. Oh, that's cool. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Some hotels even have music playing in there. So, this decision was no music, no sound. You choose when you get to the room. I can show you this corner. And here's the hotel DJ booth. So, for uh, weekends. This is where the international superstar DJs will be gracing the decks. So here we are back in one of the cabins um, on 4 at Yotel, New York. And um, really from my perspective, being brought in as a sound architect, curator, music director, um, I'm so thrilled to, be, to have been given this opportunity to program what I consider to be an appropriate and um, calming, relaxing, uh, pleasant experience. Um, if music is one of the, uh, if music after smell is one of the most um, profound senses for memory, I want people to come away from Yotel with great memories and the music is part of that, so uh, the soundtrack, very important.